Hello there, dear Maltese learners. Uh, in this series of lectures, we're seeing the Maltese verbs. And this time for number 16, it's time to see the verb to repeat or to return. Uh, because we've seen twice more or less the same verb, let's find out if you can make the conjugation of this verb. So that's uh, erja and erjau uh, in the imperative and here are the root consonants uh, are the r the j and the i so uh, make the full conjugation and when you're done hit um, continue to see this video so now you'll have to put it on pause uh, because i'm going to s tell you the uh, the solutions so now the solution for the present tense is regular and djt Nerja, terja, yerja, terja. Then uh, nerjau, terjau, yerjau. So I did a little bit quick here for the the uh, the single. Uh, so let's do that again. Nerja, terja, yerja. Terja. So for the past tense, you know that uh, for the mama, the third person, you switch these two letters here. So you will have reja as the mama, and because you will add et at the end of the the word uh, for the female form, that's rejet. So reg ein, so the ein here, and then et. Uh, and for the uh, the plural third person, so they repeated. That's reject. Uh, sorry, rejow. Uh, so uh, that's here like this one. Just this one is uh, switched around. For the first person, the ch the ein uh, changes into a j. So let's see uh, the conjugation here. Rejait. Rejait. Reja, with the ein here, don't forget it. Rejet, Rjaina, Rjaitu, Reja. So that's it for the conjugation of to repeat, to return. Sometimes it's used with another verb. Um, uh, when there's two verbs in Maltese, uh, for example, erja um, nahdem, uh, work again, or something like that, uh, uh, sorry, erja ahdem, uh, work again, then the um, second verb will take the same form as the first verb. Uh, for example, um, uh, he wants to work in English. Uh, in Maltese, it would be literally translated, he wants, he works, because the conjugation will be twice the same. There's uh, there's no infinitive. There is a mama, but it's not used if you have to use two verbs at the same time. So, uh, don't forget that. Uh, and now you know how to uh, conjugate the verb to repeat, to return.